either Matt has gone crazy or this week is National National Assisted Living Week. And apparently they like to have some fun out yes. at Quail Ridge Assisted Living. Joining <laughs> us today is Jody Thomas from Quail Ridge. Thank you so much, Jody, for joining us today. First, let's 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 find out. Why, Why do you hat? have a laugh, lobster on your head? <laughs> we find a lot of reasons to celebrate. And during National Assisted Living Week, it's a time for our residents, the community, our staff to appreciate and enjoy life. Okay. And today, as part of National Assisted Living Week, we had Crazy Hat Day. <laughs> oh, nice. And so you're wearing the hat that I did, Don, all day long. And um, we hat. had great Qualifies. fun. 80, 90 percent of our residents were in hats very similar. Anybody walk up behind you with a big bowl of melted butter? <laughs> Not today. Not today. <laughs> you know, I think it's fair to say that sometimes when the elderly, you know, it's decided that they're going to go to an assisted living center, mm -hmm. they think life is over. That Absolutely. didn't mean that it's done. But that is not the case. There's a lot of living that still goes Absolutely. on. Absolutely. People are terrified at the prospect. They don't understand what assisted living is. Mm -hmm. We are not a clinical model. Our folks, the average age of about 85, in their day, it was, uh, it was the old nursing homes. And everybody oh. knows the visual that comes to your head when you hear that. Mm -hmm. And that is not what assisted living is. Assisted living is a home-like setting, private apartments. They maintain their independence. I always tell folks it's an apartment with staff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice. And so it's not that same old visual anymore. Mm -hmm. nice. I'd like some staff. Can I get, <laughs> I am Can I get in on that? I tell folks all the time, you know, we cook for you, we clean for you, mm -hmm. we take people places, and the only thing that we want them worrying about that day is what they're going to be doing, huh. what's fun. What activity they're mm -hmm. going to be You know, absolutely. Day. And let's talk a little bit. What are some of the activities that you do there? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> what? Don't I'll do. We'll have day. a half-hour show. I know. <laughs> Folks have, again, this image that it's, it's old people uh -huh. and they don't have fun. And I was telling Matt earlier, they're just you and me in 30, 40, 50 years. Mm -hmm. We like we go to the Museum of Idaho in Idaho Falls. Huh. We've been fishing to lava. This week we are celebrating the theme of National Assisted Living Week is art for the ages. Mm -hmm. And so we're celebrating some artistic abilities and we're gonna nice. highlight that this week. We have I want to make sure and invite folks Thursday at 6 o'clock, we are having an art show. We have a lot of local artists that have been kind enough to bring their art in. Mm -hmm. We've also been doing art classes and different things with our residents, so there oh, will cool. be their things on display. We have a live band. We'll have oh. dessert and drinks. Again, it's it's a great time, and we invite the community to join us for okay. that. Okay, I think most people don't realize there's that much getting out into the community. Oh, heavens, they are, they are busy. Cool. They are living their lives. I tell families yeah. all the time, my greatest pleasure is after a resident has moved in and a family member comes in and says, I'm here to see mom. And we have to say, you know what? You should call first because they're not here. <laughs> <laughs> they're out doing something. They're out yeah. enjoying themselves. And that is our goal in assisted uh, living mm -hmm. is to add quality, not to take away anything, but to add to their independence. Mm -hmm. Folks actually can gain independence by being in our environment. They're no longer sitting at home waiting for when their daughter can take them somewhere or when they can do things, they have a staff now. So if they need a six pack of Coke from the store, we're gonna go get it. Okay. If they wanna go out to the library, if they wanna go to a restaurant, if, you know, we have live bands, we have happy hours, we have things. Huh. So they're not just sitting and waiting for someone mm -hmm. to come, they're making it happen. I cool. love so that So Jody, concept. do you find that uh, the residents uh, you exhaust the residents more, or the residents <laughs> exhaust you? A little bit of both. <laughs> <laughs> Depends All right. on the day. Very good. So Thursday at 6 o'clock, Yes. come on out to Quail Ridge. Please Very do. Good. Oh, that's fantastic. And I can't wait for Silly Sock Day. <laughs> that's thanks. tomorrow. Jody, thanks for joining us Thank today. you.